2016 Olympics start August 5th. And one week from that day, Pisgah High alum Tori Bowie, well, she will begin her quest to bring home a gold medal. But not just for her, she'll represent the unincorporated community in Rankin County, Sand Hill. She's one of the fastest women in the U.S., has an endorsement with Adidas, and over the weekend finished first in the 200-meter dash to claim her second spot in the Rio Olympics. Ain't no doubt, you know, she's going to win it. So just so much excitement. But according to her former bus driver and school secretary, it all started at a small school in Sand Hill, Pisgah High. She played basketball and she ran track. There's never been a time when I asked her any question. Is she not say, ma'am, behind it? The 2016 Olympian can thank Angela Reynolds for some of her track success. A former basketball slash track coach made it mandatory for all hoopers to run track. Before then, Bowie had no interest in the sport. I told him it was a requirement to play basketball. You have to run track. So it didn't go well with the girls because of the uniforms. They didn't want to wear the short uniform. But she'll tell you now, I didn't want to run track. Once Bowie joined the squad, the team won back-to-back -back state titles. Get this, with no track to call their own. We ran around the football field in the grassy area. Now, Tori is a favorite to win both the 100 and 200 meters dashes at the Rio Olympics. That has everyone in the small Rankin County town on their mark, getting set and ready to go. Um. I've been to Oregon to watch her compete. I've, I'm going to Rio. What she came from to where she is now, and she's still so grateful and humble with everything that comes her way. So. 